morning. Um, it's kind of not morning here anymore, but it's fine. So we, I had like a pancake for breakfast, a vegan pancake. Uh, but then Dakota had a much healthier breakfast. Um, Dakota really wanted to make donuts today. And I decided to go ahead and do that. So we found this recipe on Pinterest, I'll link it below, that we kind of followed. I'm not like very detailed about following recipes. I figure what I do is gonna be good enough. So we have this little mini donut maker thing that I've had for years. Um, we use that and I'll show you how those turned out. Um, for lunch for Michael and I, and maybe Coda will have some, I don't know. Um, we made some baked potatoes, and I will show you those. We have vegan mozzarella on them, and then onions, tomatoes, mushrooms, they're all roasted on, um, some nutritional yeast, salt, garlic, pepper, really good. And then I made a guac to put on top of them. And the guac, I tried to add like a little more like cheesiness to it, so I like used vinegar and uh, vegan milk to like it makes like a buttermilk kind of like sour creamy curdly thing and then you put that in there and then some nutritional yeast and salt pepper garlic um, all the good stuff so season it how you want but that's just kind of what we did I'll show you how it turned out It's like 8 o'clock, uh, so that's fun. I uh, didn't mean to leave this late, but I got to do it now. The store closes at 9. Okay, we're home from the store. I just did a live on Instagram. Uh, if you want to follow me on Instagram, yes, should. It's really fun. I think most of the people who follow me on here or who are subscribed also are on my uh Instagram, but if you're not, check it out, Aruka Rose. <laughs> I've started doing live streams where I talk about astrology and everything uh, we want to talk about, yoga, pole dancing, um, family stuff, whatever, vegan food, all of that, uh, Thursdays, Thursday evenings on my Instagram. Um, Alright, so behind me, Michael made this beautiful arrangement of everything we bought. Look at that. He is so much, like, he is so detail-organized and, like, makes everything look beautiful. It's... Ugh. Today was a huge haul. All right, here we go. Let's go through all the things. We... The normal bread we get, it wasn't here, but we did get another sourdough. Um, these are the best tortillas. Um, these are the absolute best tortillas. We got a lot of chips this week because we're trying to buy more of our snacks from the store rather than from like gas stations, convenience stores. So we got potato chips, we got corn chips, uh, like basically Fritos. Um, we got tortilla chips, or did I say that? Potato chips, corn chips, tortilla chips, puffs. Amazing. Um, these are just Himalayan sea salt puffs. They also make an apple cider vinegar flavor that's really really good and like a fake cheesy flavor that's also really really good um speaking of cheese we got chow these are vegan um cheese slices and they're like i don't know they're just really good <laughs> um we have officially switched to miyoko's vegan butter um it is like a tiny bit more expensive than earth balance but it if you look at the ingredients they are so much better and they t it really does i think taste better than earth balance um, yeah, Earth Balance has, um, palm tree, palm, it's not palm tree, uh, Earth Balance has palm oil in it, so this, uh, is better for the environment since it does not, um, revolutionizing dairy with plants. This is a great brand, by the way, just in general. Um, we like to get these vegan spring rolls a whole lot. Um, these are like a whole dinner, like one bag, so like I'll have a bag and he'll have a bag and that's like our frozen dinner meal for the week. Um, these are for Michael mainly. Uh, these are like chicken nugget things. He makes a lot of sandwiches with these. Um, and I mean, and they're vegan, obviously vegan. 
um, frozen strawberries and frozen raspberries. I've been starting to make a lot more smoothies with Coda. Um, I just love that so much. Uh, I need to make more juice again, but uh, our juicer's dirty and it hasn't been cleaned. And it's like kind of nasty. I got to clean it real good. Um, these were on clearance today. What? 99 cents. Coda, it's like these are good like little Coda snacks. Um, we got the turmeric and hot tonic shots. Um, we've been having a lot of muscle pain per, per use because we do a lot of things. Um, and it's just really good even if you don't have like a big pain. Um, you probably do have inflammation somewhere in your body because you're a living human being and you um, put stress on your body in some kind of way. Um, and turmeric will really help break with inflammation. Um, there's a lot of people who like have severe pain and they will go in and get these shots every day and they make a huge difference. Um, they also have pineapple in them. So if you can't get these exact shots because maybe you don't live by me. Um, if you mix turmeric... If you get turmeric and you want to juice it like this, um, also put it with pineapple juice or black pepper uh, because that will get uh, bromelain in there with it and that will make it absorb so much more. Um, uh, if you, yeah, pineapple is, has bromelain and then pepper has, is it pepperine? I don't remember. Um, but it has a compound that will make it uh, go in. I'm really tired so I'm not remembering all my science words. Um, I have Strite Hill, Kite, I have Kite Hill Strawberry <laughs> Yogurt. It's vegan. Um, it's made with almond milk and it is so good. I really like putting hemp seeds in these or like mixing them with like bananas and peanut butter. It's like so good. Um, I got a lot of essential oils uh, because I was, I've been out of some like major ones for a while. Um, peppermint, huge bottle. Eucalyptus, huge bottle. Lavender, huge bottle. I will never have to buy these again. Um, and patchouli. I got some patchouli. It just kind of called to me today. <laughs> um, bronchial wellness for kids. So if your kids are having like a lot of coughs or like um, sneezes or like congestion, I know that's like really common for this time of year and kids just, you know, they're building their immune systems. They're catching a lot of things. Uh, Coda does super, super, super good with this. Um, you do it... Um, twice a day I believe um he hasn't had it in a while yeah um code like his age he would have it two times a day older kids can have it up to four times a day um we would just do this in the morning and then um again at night before he goes to bed so these work so well for him I can't recommend them more <laughs> um then we got a ton of little mandarin oranges uh code is all about that and I figured you know what this is like one of the healthiest snacks he can have, and he will down these so fast. Uh, we got apples, we got avocados, we got uh, onion, we got tomatoes, we got lemons, we got um, shiitake mushrooms. Look at how beautiful they are. Um, we They are local, if I haven't said that in every other video. Um, I really wanted these radishes today. Um, I really like these. I grow them in the summer. Um, I know I could grow them other times of the year, but I, grow, I do grow them in the summer. And um, they're just, like, so good. Like, a really good snack. Um, bananas. We've got Yukon gold potatoes. Celery. Uh, cucumber. Uh, spinach. This is super spinach. It's got other stuff in it. It's not just spinach, even though it says super spinach. It, the marketing's kind of confusing, but I like it. I like what they're doing. Um... Carrots. These are for Coda. Um, and then we got broccoli, uh, also mainly for Coda. And lastly, uh, this was also in Clarence, and this just looked so good. Um, <laughs> wild berry fruit spread with chia. Look at that. Oh, these are so good. Some salsa. I got some vegan -ays, uh, vegan mayo, and it it's like the, one of the main ingredients for making my vegan aioli and um it's so good this is the absolute best vegan alfredo sauce look at that oh my god look at oh my god some pasta sauce we're trying this lemon garlic um dressing it looked really good and it's vegan Michael really likes this goddess dressing. And this is the milk I send to Coda's school because nobody 
can scoff at this milk. <laughs> All right. It does have, it is fortified. I used to drink Orgain a lot when I was pregnant. Um, it, it has everything in it uh, that people could complain about. So I send this to school so nobody can complain. <laughs> so yeah, that's, that's everything I got. Cute, do you want in? Oh, okay, you did want in. It's cold outside, puppy. Dia, dia. box from 100% pure. from This is all vegan. This is a vegan. Wonderful ingredients. Wonderful ingredients. It, the makeup is fruit pigmented. The medicine that is fruit pigmented. It's actually healthy for your skin. It's healthy for the skin. <laughs> I thought it might be fun to open the box with you guys. <laughs> Can to open the box today. I'm excited. I'm excited. <laughs> Let's open it up. Well, you see what we got? I have the mattifying primer. It comes in this little tube. I don't I don't think that that's going to focus, but how nice is that? You want to pop the bubbles? Gym Deluminizer. And I got the rose gold color. Fruit pigmented cheek tint. This was not something I would have gotten on my own. Um, just because the color, the strawberry color, probably isn't a color I would use normally. But this was free with um, the amount I spent. So, okay, this is the best shampoo and conditioner I've ever used in my life. It's kelp and mint. Uh, this is the conditioner. I have a lot, some of the shampoo left, so I didn't need to buy more. Also, they were sold out. <laughs> Let's get this one out. You ready? Can I play with it? Here, I got more bubbles for you to pop. Can I play with it? See, watch. Watch it when you pop the bubbles. Okay, I got a dark, um, I got a dark foundation powder to use as contour. Mm -hmm. Oh, look that you got a sticker, Coda. What is it? It has an avocado on it. What? It's an avocado sticker. I'm having a hard time with this, actually. Can I play with these? They might need to work on their stickers. <laughs> All right, here's your sticker. Avocado sticker, show the camera. Turn it over. Avocado. Avocado. <laughs> Alright, and the last thing I got, I'm trying this. This is the blood orange shower gel. That just sounded really appealing. 